If I was an advice columnist, this is the advice I would give you. Men, never trust a woman who looks good in every photograph. It means that she deletes all the gross ones and that she's probably prone to hiding things. Guys, you want to get it on with a woman? If you tell her you love her in her beauty, she'll let you love her in her booty. Ladies, the next time a man tries to impress you by telling you he loves the natural female form, stop wearing makeup and let your leg and armpit hair grow just to prove his ass wrong. Do you think your life sucks? Why not walk a mile in someone else's rollerblades? Are you trying to find the secret to happiness? What about hanging out with your family, spending time with your friends, traveling the world, starting a new hobby? See, there are many secrets to happiness and you know what they are. I think what you're looking for is the secret to not being a moody, ungrateful prick. Damn, I'm so gangster. I smoke a million blunts a day. And by smoke, I mean cry. And by blunts, I mean tears. If I was a dinosaur, I'd be the Tyrannosaurus Gross. Now, how do you deal with a girl who's cheating on you? It's simple. Just reassemble the original Mighty Ducks hockey team and chase her in a flying V formation, saying quack, 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 quack. She, sh she should expect that anyway. Now life can be exciting depending on how you look at it. Some call it a ceiling fan. I call it the most intense carnival ride in my house. Now are you ever alone and you decide to practice your somersaults while listening to the song Take a Bow by Madonna while wearing a studded leather thong? Uh, no, actually. <laughs> you don't? Yeah, you weirdo. I know that some of you have boring relationships. Girls, I know that if your boyfriend was a cartoon movie about dinosaurs, his name would be The Bland Before Time. And men, remember that if you and your friends get in a small argument with another group of guys, make sure to spend the rest of the night over embellishing the story. Like all you did was exchange some words on the sidewalk, but the rest of the night you're talking like, and then I went in and I tripped him and I put him in headlock and I was like, who's your mother now? It's like that didn't happen. Dudes, shit. <laughs> Are you poor? I have the greatest idea for a business. Why not open a shop that sells bandages and band-aids and just hire one guy to stand outside and cut people as they walk by? You'll be a millionaire. You'll be a cock ass motherfucking zillionaire. That's the new number. Did any of my viewers out there just get dumped? Remember, there are plenty of other fish in the sea. The lesson here, the sea is fucking terrifying. Now I know it can ruin a friendship if you and your friend are competing for the same job. So my advice to people in this situation is if you want to keep the friendship tight, just sit down with your friend and have a nice chat over a few beers or just have a friendly, hilarious gunfight. Now do you want to make some easy money? Apparently horror movies are making tons of cash these days. Write a horror script. I wrote one. I wrote the scariest story ever made. Do you want to hear it? Once upon a time, there was a guy who pointed a flashlight at his chin. I also want to make a spin-off of the show Dexter. I'll call it Texter. And it's about an Amish guy who sneaks out of his electricity-free home to text people. Well, you disgusting hangnails, I gotta get out of here and pour myself a nice bowl of poverty for breakfast. I'm so hungry I could eat off the McDonald's healthy choice menu. And always remember these three things. Guys, you're not an extreme skateboarder unless your board is made out of a living alligator. It's a sad moment when you realize that Jurassic Park 3 sucks, but it's still better than anything you've ever made in your entire life. And they're called basketball shoes because you play basketball in them. So start calling them ho shoes because playa, I want you to play a bunch of hoes in them. And women, men can be hoes too. Go play a bunch of bro hoes. Bros! 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 Brawls. I'm a gigantic teapot, tall and stout. Here is my handle, and here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, run, because I'm a gigantic fucking talking teapot. I, I'd be pretty scared if I were you. If I do this, it'll burn your fucking face with scalding hot water.